Hello all. Welcome to Edutains. Today we will learn about effects of temperature and pressure on matter. Let us begin by learning the effects on matter due to change in temperature. When the temperature increases, solid objects get converted into liquid and the liquid gets converted into gases. But if the temperature is decreased, the gas molecules combine to form liquid and liquid gets converted into solid substances. Thus, rise or fall in temperature causes change in state and matter when we increase temperature. Heat is absorbed in the form of energy. The kinetic energy of the molecules of a solid increase on absorption of heat and they begin to vibrate with larger amplitude. The particles leave their fixed position and start moving more freely. Gradually, there is a phase change from solid to liquid. The temperature at which a substance changes from solid into liquid state at one atmospheric pressure is called its melting point. The melting point of ice is 273.16 Kelvin or 0 degree Celsius. Process of melting that is change of solid state into liquid state is also known as fusion. One should note that during the phase change from solid state to liquid state or the liquid state to gaseous state, there is no change in the temperature. Although heat is continuously absorbed, why does it happen? This happens because of the phenomenon of latent heat. Latent heat is the energy absorbed by a given substance to change its state. Latent heat of fusion is the amount of heat energy required to change 1 kg of solid into liquid at its melting point. If heat is supplied further, the kinetic energy of the composite particles of the liquid increases and the molecules start to vibrate more energetically. When the molecules gain enough energy, they start escaping from the surface of the liquid due to the process called evaporation and the temperature at which the liquid starts to boil and changes into gaseous state at one atmospheric pressure is called the boiling point of the substance. We define latent heat of vaporization as the energy required to change 1 kg of liquid into gas at one atmospheric pressure at its boiling point. The kinetic theory of matter explains that with the increase in temperature, the matter changes from solid to liquid to gas. We will learn about it some other day. However, there are certain substances that change directly from solid to gas or vice versa. This phenomenon is called sublimation. The solids like ammonium, chloride, camphor, naphthalene and anthracene are sublime. This is camphor. Camphor, when heated, converts directly into gas. Let's perform an activity to separate a mix of ammonium chloride and salt. Take a mixture of ammonium chloride and salt in a china dish, cover it, inverted conical transparent funnel. At the other end of the funnel, put a cotton plug so that vapor could not come out. Now. Place china dish on the burner. As the ammonium chloride is sublime, after heating, 
it will directly be converted to vapor. And this vapor will again condense at the upper colder part of funnel to form solid NH4Cl. In this way, the ammonium chloride and salt can be separated by the sublimation. Now let us discuss about the effect of pressure on the matter. The effect of pressure is negligible on solid, but it is more on liquid and most on gases. When pressure is applied on a container of gas, the gas particles come close to each other. This reduces the kinetic energy of the particles. When pressure is increased further, the gas particles come very close to each other and consequently get converted to liquid. Moreover, change in pressure also causes change in the boiling and melting point of a substance. By increasing the pressure and decreasing the temperature, gas can be liquefied. By increasing the pressure, carbon dioxide can be changed to solid. Solid carbon dioxide is known as dry ice. Thus, it can be said that pressure and temperature determines the state of a substance, whether it will be solid, liquid or gas. That's all for today. If you like our videos, please do not forget to like, share and subscribe our channel. Suggestions and comments are always welcome. Thank you.